Hi, I'm Chris Suprock from Suprock Technologies. So you've got your Candela amplifier. Now, how do you set it up and use it? Well, you'll get two pieces that come with the package. The first piece is the top piece, which is the Candela amplifier itself. This has a heat sink on the bottom, which collects heat from the candle. And then there's a heat sink on the top, which takes that heat and convects it to the ambient air. There's a light on this as well, which is going to light up when the candle gets warm. The second thing that comes with the kit is an oil burner. So this oil burner allows you to get a good consistent flame that doesn't change its location, which is important because you can run this off a candle, but if you want it to be consistent and run for many hours without having to readjust where the candela amplifier is located, an oil burner is a great alternative to a candle. Let me start the oil burner so that we can get this process started. When you start the oil burner, you're going to want to adjust it so that it doesn't have black sooty smoke. Using the adjusting knob, you can get the flame down to where it's nice clean burning and it will heat up and then once it's heated up you can adjust it and make sure that there's no sooty smoke or anything emitting from the oil burner. This is just like a normal oil burning candle or a lamp for people that are used to lamps. After you've got that on, you're going to want to put the candela amplifier on top so that it's resting on top of the posts and it's, it will be level on top of the post so that it doesn't have any movement. At this point, you just have to wait for it to warm up. And there's a discussion of time constants on the website talking about thermal mass and how long something takes to warm up. But this will take probably about 30 seconds to a minute because there's a chunk of metal that has to warm up on top of this lamp. And once that gets up to temperature, It'll be touchable, but it will be warm enough to start the thermoelectric generation process. 